Hey guys, what's up? This thing from 3D Print and Tech. Today we're going to do a review on AO filament. This is the uh, filament, it's a uh, 1.75 millimeter. And, uh, to be honest, um, AO have not paid me anything to do with this review. This review is totally unbiased and um, is totally honest. So in no way have they paid me. The only thing they have done is supplied me the filament uh, to review. Right, The where do I start? The temperature on this is 190 to 230. When I did a test with um, the calipers, it came out at 1.7, which were quite good, to be honest. I have uh, had more expensive uh, filament, which has come out a bit on and off, uh, really. But this has uh, stayed a bit constant. It's not brittle. Um, there's no bubbling. There's no stringing or anything. With a lot of more expensive ones that I pay usually between 20 to 25, 30 pounds a roll for a kilo roll, I usually get stringing or some bubbling. Bearing in mind, I have printed this uh, filament on the Artillery Genius, which is an all metal hot end volcano. As you know, volcanoes uh, use higher temperatures than normal hot ends. So the. Um, yeah, go on. The melting point is a bit different. This, I printed uh, with this uh, filament, and the filament, uh, I printed it at 210 for the first layer, and then 200 for the rest. Uh, so it worked quite low um, for an uh, all-metal lot end, which really surprised me. I've had a look at the filament, felt it, can't feel any bubbles in uh, the filament, no lumps or anything. It is quite smooth. When you print with it, it's quite smooth. Um, so I'm quite happy with it, uh, to be honest. Um, I will show you a calibration cube I did uh, with it. Bearing in mind, uh, what you've got to remember is I am using an artillery genius which uses an AC bed and an all metal volcano. So you can, if you don't use uh, the right supports, uh, then you are going to get a bit of um, a tilt on the, the edge of the print. Uh, where there's been uh, where it's been directly onto the heat bed. This is a calibration cube I did on the Autolog Genius with uh, this PLA. As you can see, with um, this, uh, there's no stringing, there's no bubbling, there's no bad um, surfaces or anything. Um, all the lines are smooth. And everything uh, the bottom layer came out smooth the only thing i did notice which was my own fault i did uh, make the mistake of forgetting to use a brim or a skirt or um, supports so i did get this light bow on the edge there which to be fair uh, weren't bad uh, to say I will use a new volcano and name um, AC eBed because uh, I have used other filaments where <laughs> that's uh, bored really badly. Um, 
can I find the uh, bad faults with this filament? To be honest, I've not come across any. I can't say a bad thing about it. Um, it is well worth the money. It's like I say, a lot of uh, filaments, IPLA, I do pay between 20 and 30 pound a kilo. Surprisingly enough, this is good filament. Um, and I'm being honest here. And um, the price is pretty goddamn uh, good. The price of this uh, filament is about between roughly 12 12 95 a kilo. Uh, there is postage uh, cost on it, which is roughly about four four ninety nine a roll. Um, I have spoke to EO, and they said if you order uh, five rolls, you will get free shipping. So that's pretty good. Um, I have got the other ones I wanted to test uh, as well. I've only tested this one, like I say, AO, I've never heard of it before, until I saw these. Um, so I uh, was pretty sceptical on how well it was going to print, because usually if you get a cheap filament, you get cheap quality. But with this one, no shattering, no uh, nothing, no stringing. Uh, so pleasantly surprised uh, to get a low cost uh, filament, uh, but I uh, cost uh, high quality print. So I will give uh, this another try. Um, I will bu uh, be buying more of this uh, as well. So yeah, um, all in all, good filament. Uh, I would give it five out of five. Um. Definitely worth a try. AO are based in uh, Leeds, so anybody in Yorkshire, they're not uh, far uh, away at all. I have got uh, the details if you want to get in touch with them and buy filament off them. Uh, they have got an Instagram page and they have got a Facebook page, which I will share with you now. Um, so it's like, ba -ba, bear with me. Um, right, here, which is here. So you can get AO on Instagram at uh, AO3D. Or you can get them on Facebook um, on AO3D. And they have got a WhatsApp uh, number, which is plus 44 077 639 um, It's like I say, they've not paid me to do this review. Um, it is good on this review. And... I would definitely recommend the filament. So, what you're waiting for, get some ordered. Give it a try. What you got to lose? At 12, 12, 99, you can't go wrong. Right, guys. So, um, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, review. And we will be doing more reviews uh, later on. Um, so, happy 3D printing. Have fun.